this is the first step in upgrading the 42. Um, first thing you do before anything, or you have to do, is, is um, upgrade your cooling. ProBoat does give you a, a twin outlet rudder. For some reason, from the factory, they only use half of it, so um, I don't understand why. But <coughs> So I've now got a cooling for each circuit. Water comes in around here. Uh, first one goes to the motor and then out the back here. Um, second one is only for the speed controller and that comes out the back here. So rather than going out the side where it's in the way of your batteries, um, I've chosen to use our um, exhaust style water outlets. <coughs> Obviously they look cooler as well. I've gone with the red tubing to kind of match the orange stuff on the boat and the, the red hose covers. Um, there's not much to it really. I've used the original um, hose holders even though our hose is thicker than the, the the standard one but they do still fit in there and just cable tied everything together when you do it just make sure that you do it how the factory does it in the way of you start from the bottom of the cooler and exit from the top that way the cooler fills up with water and then um, it work you don't have any air in there it works the best possible way and uh, yeah, it's probably you know 10 or 15 minute job at the most the only thing you have to watch is when you're drilling the extra holes um, because of the webbing that's in the back here you don't want to run into any of the webbing so um, what I did is is drill this one here from the inside with a long drill bit um, right in the middle of the webbing and then I just measured the distance and made it exactly the same over here so you know obviously it's even and it didn't run into webbing um, in here it's pretty easy, you just have to just watch what you're doing and that's it.